this building behind me was the former headquarters of the KGB Ooh. in Tallinn. Yeah. Day two in Tallinn. Actually, it's really our official day one because we got here late at night last night. Um, we're not really sure where we're having lunch, but we're going to start with that. And then I think Tom said something about a presidential palace or something. We will find out. I think we are by the President's Palace. Um, we're actually by his gardens right now. And this is like just this cool little tunnel with like Christmas lights all over it. It's really romantic. It is. We're having a romantic <laughs> moment. We're Ooh, wrong. Rod's gonna be jealous. <laughs> Russian warship on the way to Finland in 1893. Ah. It sunk and the angel on the top is facing in the direction or the supposed direction of the wreck. Why did it crash? Why did it sink? Stormy water. McDonald's. <laughs> McDonald's. I know it's booming in there. The president's house and McDonald's. Okay. Welcome to the past, everyone. <laughs> yeah. It really is like the past. According to Tom, this is one of the most picturesque places in Tallinn, and I can really believe it. There's like it's cobblestone streets, cobblestone walls, there's Christmas lights everywhere. Um, we just passed a glass blower's place, there's stained glass windows being sold there. Oh, it's such a cute place. Welcome to Christmas. So what is this called again? It's called Vanatali. Vanatali. It's old Tali. Oh. And it's an Estonian liqueur. This is the original version. There are versions with cream, ice cream flavor, uh, chocolate. Ice cream flavor. There's an ice cream. Ice cream is a flavor. Yeah. What? Yeah. <laughs> and you think, no, no, no. Ice cream's not a flavor. You have flavors of ice cream. Yeah. But, no, no, no. Ice cream is a flavor. And when you try it, you'll realize that it actually is. So what is this one? This one's the original. Original. Okay. Straight up the original. OG. The OG. The <laughs> OG. So, 10 seconds. Ten of six. Ten of six. Oh yeah. Look how good the shit was. I'm doing it for ages. This is fun. Uh huh. Do you want to have a look? Yeah. You just go in and you just describe what kind of beer you like. Yeah. And then the guy is like, oh, okay, one of these four. I want to do that, yeah. yeah. So, it doesn't look it now, it looks actually quite beautiful with the stars yeah. in the window and that sort of stuff, but the main part is down here. So you see where the cellar would be in the window spaces. Mm -hmm. They bricked it up. So the headquarters of the KGB wasn't just the administrative headquarters, also places where they would interrogate people as well. So this little plaque, here began the road to suffering for thousands of Estonians. Hmm. We 
really get a sense at the moment of just how quiet it can be. I mean, if we were here in an hour or two, we'd have this whole place to ourselves. Come here at 10 p.m., dead midnight. I've gone for like 1 a.m. walks before. Something about walking around at night here. Everything's so quiet. There aren't that many people in Tallinn, but it's just quiet and cold. And you turn a corner and there's just a beautiful sight of some beautiful building that has some deep history. It's great. Really enjoying Tallinn and really enjoying this tour. Nuestra guía acaba de decir el significado de los colores de la bandera de Estonia. Um, hay un, el azul es para el cielo y el negro es para la línea de árboles y también hay la arena de la playa. Don't forget to subscribe to join us in our travels.